Thank you, Sam Simmons. The city of Tulsa tries to press the restart button on a major project to revitalize a piece of land in the Greenwood District. A community meeting is looking to set the record straight. Two News Oklahoma's Samson Tamajani was there earlier this evening. Bruh. Bruh. With an often unhappy crowd response, the city's lead economic growth agency, Partner Tulsa, looked to explain what went wrong with the black-owned Be Good Development Partners' $68 million plan to revitalize nine acres containing the old Evans Fintube industrial site. You're not going to see anybody who's, who's any more disappointed than us at the fact that after over two years of work, we're having to restart uh, from the beginning. Executive Director Kyan Camus says the plan initially showed good signs, but that two key companies giving capital to the project backed out, forcing Be Good Development to resubmit its plans. But last week, partner Tulsa says the resubmitted work from the group had not fulfilled all the requirements and they had to be dropped as official master developers. That decision was not easy. It was really difficult. But in the meeting... Respect this process too, okay? Disagreements arose. Several critical voices among the audience of nearly 100 people demanded more clarity and were not satisfied. Among them, Natalie Sims. We are toiling over this every night. This is a this is a hundred years of abuse from the city, and we are saying, hey, give us the opportunity. Equity is not just about talk. There has to be action. In Tulsa's Greenwood District, Samson Tamajani, 2 News, Oklahoma. Well, City Councilor Vanessa Hall Harper said after that meeting that the city will organize more town halls to address concerns and hear from the development and capital groups involved.